This morning, we learned the economy created 336,000 jobs in September alone. That means since I've taken office, we've created 13.9 million new jobs. President Joe Biden taking a victory lap Friday over September's turbocharged jobs report. It's Bidenomics. We're growing the economy from the middle out the bottom up, not the top down. September's gains reflect the largest monthly jump since January and the unemployment rate holding steady from August at 3.8 percent. Hospitality and leisure led the hiring surge like restaurants, hotels and travel, areas that previously struggled to recover after the pandemic, followed by government and health care. Hourly average wages were just shy of estimates, but still trending up. We still have more work to do on inflation, but also some uh, some growth in wages, especially among the lowest paid workers. The strong jobs report could be too much of a good thing, points out some federal officials, noting that the central bank could keep hiking interest rates to fight inflation if it feels the economy is strong enough to handle them. Still, for most Americans, more jobs and rising wages are a win-win. It means there are more opportunities for people sharing their part of the American dream. I'm Laura Aguirre reporting. Now, when we take a look locally, Maui unemployment numbers are higher than normal for this time of year. State data shows last week just under 900 Maui residents filed for first-time unemployment benefits. This is the first time that numbers dipped below 1,000 since late August. And right here on your screen, you can see the trend in first-time unemployment claims filed over on Maui since the fires in early August.